Good afternoon, amigos. <laughs> From El Estadio Azteca, we are here for the Club America versus uh, <laughs> I Cruz Azul. Cruz Azul. Uh, this is going to be nuts. We just walked in. Lots of vendors. Lots of Club America. We're here by ourselves. Nobody <laughs> else in sight. Comment abajo y dinos who you want to win. Let's see what this is all about. <laughs> We've made it through. I had to give up my belt. They're holding it for 10 pesos, but I have a feeling I might not ever see it again. Uh, and they gave us a nice, brisk pat down. I feel. Uh, I feel ready to watch it. I feel like Homeboy got on the inner thigh there. I've never been to a soccer game before in my life, uh, not even MLS. So I think this is going to be pretty crazy. As a sports fan, coming to Azteca is a pretty big deal. Uh, they've had two, two World Cups here before, and they had the 68 Olympics. I don't know if it was in this stadium or before, but I always remember the Mexico City Olympics because that was the first time the Fosbury flop was performed on the high bar, if we have any high bar they fans out there. <laughs> they can. America. America. Seats, Luis. How are they? <laughs> hey. <laughs> All right, I've got I've got a Corona here. It was a hundred pesos. And so that's about five U.S. dollars. So that's pretty cheap for a stadium beer, but pretty expensive for for here in Mexico. Wouldn't you say that's expensive? Expensive. But for a stadium beer, I couldn't resist because at Jerry Jerry's World, Jerry's Land, whatever you call it, that would be a solid twelve dollars. Hell, how are you feeling? This is already worth it, the game hasn't started. Now, those look like the crazy fans. I don't know if you can see that, that is all cops. Luis, why are those cops there? Taking care of the porra de Cruz Azul. <laughs> because they're going to lose. What's going on in the game? It's a lot of fun. I don't even know what team to cheer for. I just want to cheer with who's cheering. I personally really like the stadium. 
What else? They sell funny things. We saw them selling donuts. retrieved my belt. I thought for sure I was never going to see that thing again, but we had to walk kind of, or we got spit out on the other side of the stadium. We walked back. Now we're going to grab some uh, Atole and uh, we'll give you our final thoughts on the America versus Cruz Azul game here at Estadio Azteca. Okay, we have a total de tamal. Dole de chocolate. And then we're gonna go get on the metro. We're, we're on a bus. Uh, instead of taking in the metro, we're gonna take the bus to another metro line. And then from the metro line, we're gonna get. We're probably gonna make it home. That was a game, whatever. It was a lot of fun. But I it was a lot of fun that like the crowd and everything was less crazy than I thought it would be. It was very intense, very emotional, very fanatical, but uh, I never once did it feel like I was kind of worried about it being pushing, shoving people, you know, chucking beers or whatnot, but I thought it was, uh, you know, it's just like going to an NFL game. You know, there could be the occasional drunk guy, but this is a bucket list. If you come, In this case, it was Luis. <laughs> yes. If you come to Mexico City and it happens to be a soccer game, yes, you have to go. I, it helps having it helps having a Luis show you around, but this was <laughs> this was pretty awesome. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. My throat is uh, this atole didn't help my throat at all, nor did the torta that I that I swallowed. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel. Click the bell to get notified. Every time we upload a new video, and uh, hopefully we'll see you tomorrow.